officially back in open session. Uh, we are thrilled tonight with the, with uh, let Tom make the official. Keith, you need to wait a minute to get that hooked up. That's good. You good? Good. good. Yeah. Uh, the Macon County Commissioners are thrilled to announce the addition of a new uh, business, a new industry here to Macon County. As most of you know, the old uh, Whitley uh, Whitley was using one of the facilities at the Macon County uh, Eagle Bears Business Development Center. Business Development Center, excuse me. And uh, since they have vacated that, we've been searching for someone to fill that uh, that would uh, meet the the needs of employment for this area. And, and so we have, we have achieved that. So Tommy Jenkins is our uh, EDC director. And uh, we will turn over to him at this time. Yeah, thank you, Mr. Chairman and uh, commission members. Uh, we're pleased to announce, thanks to your work in, in uh, providing funds to renovate the BBC Business Development Center, uh, after Whitley left, that we're going to be able to uh, fill that spot, part of that spot, with a with 7,600 square foot spot, will be occupied by a company called Harmony House Foods Incorporated. Uh, Harmony House Foods uh, is involved in the dehydrated food repackaging and distribution uh, business is what they do. Uh, they are a major player in that, in that field. Uh, 2007, they were the uh, Backpacker Magazine's product of the year. Uh, they've also- mentioned, mentioned who was the 2006 recipient of that. Was it not LLB? LLB. And these guys were the 2007. Yeah, so, so, so they're, they're good. Uh, they're they're a fine company. Uh, they've got a they've got a council uh, such outfitters as the REI and other major brands. They do a lot of wholesale and retail business. Uh, they'll be doing uh, the startup here. They'll be uh, supplying uh, to start with five to seven full time jobs. Uh, so we're real happy to have them. Uh, it's the kind of industry or business I think that we're looking forward to making county. It's clean. It fits in with the area with the Appalachian Trail all our outdoor activities and they're excited about being here and they're excited about growing so we're glad to have <coughs> also the what we're excited about too is, is the potential of future growth uh with this company this is this is a company that's, that's on the upswing yes sir it started, growth. it started on their kitchen table several years ago that they were actually repackaging with this stuff at, at night just the husband and wife and they're growing from that uh, to where they are now, and uh, we're, we're just pleased to have them. Uh, I'm before you tonight to approve so we can approve the lease, uh, lease form. In, 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 in cooperation with Mr. Jenkins and the county manager, I have prepared a proposed resolution of the county commissioners declaring the uh, property to be utilized by Harmony House Foods Incorporated. Uh, to be surface property and approving a one-year lease of the same upon uh, the uh, terms set forth in that lease. If I may hand that to the chair. Yes. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Uh, Mr. Uh, Jenkins has negotiated uh, the rent terms on that, and, and we may want to give those. Okay, that term. That's a three dollars a foot. Annual rate. 1840, we'll make them say 1840. Yeah, it's $1,840 per month rent. Uh, <coughs> and that, if I could, Mr. Chairman, that also leaves us with an additional uh, 3,600 uh, feet of space uh, for future use. So. This is all been clean, ready for use. Yes, sir. And, John, this document lays out that rent, it, it defines the space, it also uh, defines it by, uh, by drawing. The yellow back. The yellow is the space, and the uh, blue is the company. I would uh, entertain a motion to approve these, or if you'd like to ask more questions of Mr. Jenkins with the attorney, that would be appropriate. We appreciate the work, Tom. We know that it's been going on for a while, and we really appreciate. Uh, you know, we thought it was just a pie in the sky at one time, but I think you brought it together. We can't, Jim. We can't make the. The second week Jack Horton was here, he and I went out to this building. And that was his first thing to do. He said, we got to get this thing back where it's supposed to be. And uh, so I think the county manager, It's almost full. That's right. So, and let's, let's, let's mention as, as part of this, that this is the 
fifth. That's correct. This is the fifth business that we've been able to assist uh, in starting in that uh, in that facility in that uh, for, for the purpose of generating. And in the last sixty jobs. days, I've had four more. Uh, I would term serious inquiries. So we so could we could be uh, uh, we could be past capacity, and we're. So you might say we're on, we're on the bit of a roll. Yes, sir. And it also, it's, it's also, you know, the way, the way we're going to have to grow business in the future, I think I've talked to a couple of commissioners about this. We're going to do it organically. We're going to do it ourselves. You know, what we recruit is great. Uh, number one, we need to retain what we've got and grow it. Uh, number two, we need to grow it organically. And number three, we need to go out. And let, let's, Tom, let's go back to when, when we met in January and set goals. We, you call it, we met with you and, and we talked about this whole thing about uh, our, our top priority was to try to uh, try to retain jobs and then and then try to uh, increase and recruit industry and business and jobs for this right. area. And uh, we've been able to do that. We're fortunate that we have. And uh, as you said, and I think we said then, uh, a lot of the businesses that we're looking at are, are ones that are not your uh, traditional, I guess, businesses in this area, uh, but but there are businesses that are, as you say, are these uh, for new generation businesses that a lot of uh, businesses generate through the internet through high tech, right. uh, and, and this this is a perfect example of that. Right now, uh, the fiber optic capability was a determining factor with this, uh, and because we have such high the, the Boston West. We, we have our tools in place, you know, that we just got to take one step at a time to get there. Well, Mr. Chairman, if I get this correct, I'm sorry. No, sir, go ahead. No, no, go ahead. I want to thank you very much for what you've done, because uh, as we've said about this, I know of Harmony House also, I know of Mountain House, which is one of the bigger food dehydrator companies for recreation purposes, people who's going to be camping out and hiking and I think because of what our attachment with the Appalachian Trail is here, I think this is not only going to be good for the economic part of having the business here, but I think it's going to help some of our tourism and it's going to be an opportunity for people such as myself and local advertisers or local uh, for local businesses such as our outfitters to advertise their product also and to help them to grow. You're going to have a, uh, a community of that board. It's, it's going to be a good deal. I think I'd like to make a motion on it. I'm getting ready to do that, but I'm going to make a good deal. We have motion to approve the uh, resolution and the lease. Can we do that? One motion, sir. Okay. Second. We have motion and a second to approve the resolution and the lease. Uh, and this again designates the amount of the rent and the space available to Harmony Home Foods Incorporated. We will mention, as far as the discussion, this business is already established business moving here from Greenville, North Carolina, Pitt County. So we send our regrets to Pitt County. Sorry, they're losing it. We know some of the commissioners down there. Yes, so we will be disappointed. <laughs> so brother, send Brother Glenn our, our regrets. So we've taken one of his bids. Mr. Chairman, I'd like to, to thank you and the commission back in the business development center and having foresight to do it because I think in a lot of areas uh, the commission the commission wouldn't do that. Well and that, that's a good point too to, I think you need to make that clear. This is a business development area. This is not a place we're trying to get people to come in and put permanent businesses in there. And as, as Ronnie said, Mr. Horton very wisely looked at that space and, and wasn't sure that's what we were doing out there. And uh, so well, one more well I, I like to tell so, all our I don't call them tenants, I call them clients because we want to kick them out. We want to kick them out as soon as we can. So they're successful. So they can control it because it's too little. Right, Tom? That's right. So with the motion second, is there any other discussion? All in favor of approving the uh, resolution and the uh, lease agreement, signify by saying aye. 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 Motion will return to closed session, Mr. Chairman. Second. All in favor? Under section 2890. Media, we will leave for you with Mr. Jenkins. You can grill him however you'd like to. And we'll be available tomorrow.